let this be a normal field trip? With a friend? No way! Cruising on down Main Street, you're relaxed and feeling good. Yeah. Next thing that you know, you'll see it. Octopus in the neighborhood, surfing on the sound wave, swinging through the stars. Yeah. Take a left at Joe and Testin, take your second right back more to the Magic School Bus. Navigator Nostro, climb on the Magic School Bus. Come on in and don't be shy. Come on. Just to make your day complete. You might get baked into a pie on a magic school bus. Step inside, it's a wild ride. Come on, ride right on the magic school bus. Let's see, the plain dabbers connected to the dim plunker, the black bladders connected to the kitty bitter. Hmm. Always happens. The shrinker scope breaks the second the warranty runs out. Oh, bus. What am I going to do with you? Okay, ready for a rehearsal? The frizz is gonna love it. A one and a two. <laughs> Something's missing. I know it. My chemistry experiment. It's almost done. Your homework? At a time like this? I'm mixing three things together. Water, sand, and cement to get something new. Concrete. That's what's missing. <gasps> cake! I can't believe it. We forgot the cake. How can we throw a birthday party for the fridge without a cake? What a disaster. Oh, well. Oh, good morning, class. Good, good morning, morning Miss Frizzle. Frizzle. Oh, I see you've heard the news. I'm disappointed, too. The bus is acting up, so today's field trip is canceled. Oh, no. Not the chemistry trip. That's okay, Miss Frizzle. We'll get over it. It was all arranged. We were going to the bakery. Bakery? A bakery? What's that got to do with chemistry? Baking is chemistry, Ralphie. It's like my cement experiment. Mixing parts together to make something new, only tastier. A bakery is really just a small chemical plant. Except it's a plant where they make cakes. Gee, Miss Frizzle, you know, we've all been looking forward to this chemistry field trip for months. We have? Ow! Oh, yeah! We have. And, well, I don't think any of us would think our education was complete without a trip to a baker, uh, chemical plant. Why, Carlos, does everyone feel this way? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Well, I'm not one to stand in the way of taking chances, making mistakes, getting messy. Bus problems or no bus problems? To the bakery! Yes! No. Now, bus, that wasn't so difficult, was it? <laughs> Maybe it was. Great! How are we supposed to get a cake when we're this size? And how are we supposed to even get in there? Can't let a bit of shrinkage spoil our fun now, can we, Liz? Answers my question. Yes, we're going to take the bus home. <laughs> Maybe it's a problem with the iotoscope, or perhaps the enormometer. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, Liz. 
Not one of these cakes is chocolate, and that's her favorite. Besides, we're too small to buy one anyway. What do we do? Well, we could make one. Are you serious? Get real. All right! A full-scale chemistry experiment. But how will we do it without Miss Frizzle seeing? We'll just have to get her out of the bakery. But a teacher never abandons her bus. Miss Frizzle, you know how the shrinker scope is acting out? Hmm, could be the shrinker scope. Might also be the mesmer globber. But yes, Carlos. Well, there's this uh, great auto parts store right next door, see? And uh... Carlos, what a good idea. It worked. Liz, you're in charge. Oh, boy. See you later! what would happen if I used this. Unfortunately, the mechanic over there doesn't know a Dwayne Flammer from a plant hoister. So I thought I'd pop back and see how everyone's doing. Uh, uh... Say, Miss Frizzle, how'd you like to help me with a little experiment? Excellent idea. A little bit more. Keep going. Uh, man, this is tough when you're half the size of a hot dog. Could be worse, Arnold. I don't see how. Whoa! Now I do. Oh no! We Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. 
What to do, what to do? Look at us. I guess this is what happens when you travel with faulty equipment. Wait, I've got an idea. Be right back. Swell. Now what do we do? Hey, look at this. Wow. Where'd you find those great building blocks? These aren't building blocks. Catch. Hey, this is salt. Hey, everybody. I found a diamond. Check out the glimmering surface. Here's another diamond. And another one. We're gonna be rich. Not rich. Sweet. This is sugar. So this is what sugar looks like close up. See how the sides make a pattern? Things that looked alike when we were big. Look different now that we're small. Let's go, you guys. We've got to make this cake before the baker catches us. Some salt. Shortbreads, what the? Now for some flour. Ew, we can't use this flour. It's got something in it. No, it doesn't. This is what flour looks like close up. Even flour is made up of different parts. Oh, oh I, I couldn't have seen what I thought I saw. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Holy hot dog bun. Now that's what I call flower power. And now, for the best ingredient of them all. Chocolate, yummy. Hey, mixing in the chocolate makes it a new color. Sure it does, Keisha. But check out how you can still see which bits are chocolate and which ones aren't. Now we need the wet stuff. Hang on, everyone. At least milk still looks like milk. Suffering sweet rolls. It must be those blasted moths. Look. Oh. Ow. Operator, get me smug bug pest control in hurry. And now for a real egg experiment. Eggs away. Oh, yes. Pouring the milk. That's correct. And now they're... Oh, carrying eggs? <laughs> oh, what do you mean? You've never seen that behavior in Morse before. Oh, yeah? Well, same to you. Salt, sugar, flour, cream of tartar, milk, butter, eggs, chocolate, and baking soda. Hit it, Liz. So, um, Miss Brizzle, is this amazing chemistry or what? <gasps> you bet, D.A. But maybe I should check on the rest of the class now. Oh, no! The frizz is back! Come on, come on, come on, D.A. Think of something! Come on, come on, come on, D.A. Think! Hey, Miss Frizzle! What would happen if I put a whole bunch of baking soda into a bottle with the vinegar? <laughs> oh, there's only one way to find out. together make something new. A gas that pushes out the sides of the balloon. Just like filling a tire with air. <gasps> Dorothy Ann, that reminds me. The bus needs new tires. Oh, I wonder how much that'll be. I'd better go check. Thanks for reminding me. No! Whoa! Problem! Yes! Way to go, D.A. No! No, I'm not crazy! Perhaps my establishment just happens to attract a higher breed of moth. That's all. If you want anything done right, you have to do it yourself. I'm going to you. Now, the next step is to mix all the ingredients together. Phew, that's going to take some monster beaters. Good idea, Ralphie. Egg beaters! Whee! Everything's getting mixed together. Yeah, and one more ingredient's getting added. 
What's that? Air! The beaters are forcing air into the mix. All the parts are combining into one new thing. It's called cake batter. But if Miss Frizzle asks, it's chemistry. Cooks and chemists are a lot alike. Both measure out ingredients and mix them together to make something new. The only difference is... Oh, I get to taste mine! <laughs> Uh-oh, hear that? <gasps> He's gonna see us. Submarine down! Mmm, yummy. But when did I make this? Maybe that morph. <laughs> I am going crazy. <laughs> Tornado into the pan I pour. Oh, no, no, no. Not on the floor. What's happening? Why is it suddenly getting so hot? Maybe it's because the floor is on fire. I am pleased to announce the addition of the last ingredient, heat. Carlos, do you mean to say... Yes, we're in the oven, and that means... We're, we're getting baked! Help! 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 Wait a second here. If my backs are straight, we're stuck in a cake baking in an intensely hot oven. At my old school, we never got baked. Except for that time the air conditioning went. We're toast. Well, technically no, but you've got the right idea. Um, is it just me? Or is that the Tin Man from The Wizard of Oz? Maybe we should ask Toto here. <sighs> Warm one today. Miss Frizzle? Mm, feels like somebody forgot to put up the heat shield. <sighs> Much better. Oh, good. Thanks, Miss Frizzle. As I always say, if you can't stand the heat, get out of the oven. Yeah, but how? Hey, look! The batter's moving. According to my research, the baking soda is making bubbles. Wah! Now what? The batter's not the only thing getting pushed around. Uh, what's that noise? It's steam. Excellent observations. It's so hot that the water in the batter is vaporizing, making more and bigger bubbles. Ah! The batter is starting to look kind of solid. The cake, it's done. Ah, the sweet smell of parts combining into a new and magnificent whole. Now I wonder if the baker is making this cake with a special customer in mind. Huh? Oh no, we're going to have our cake and be eaten too! No digressions for indigestion, Arnold. We just... As I always say, the more mixed up things are, the better the solution. We're doomed! Wait! I've got it! Is there any baking soda left? Plenty. Vinegar? Hmm. Red, tarragon, or regular white? Uh, regular white is fine. What are you doing, D.H.? Yeah, we gotta get out of here. Well, baking soda plus vinegar equals... The gas pressure we need to push us out of here. Towards the end, you are one brilliant chemist. Gee, thanks. Come on, you guys, hurry. Yes!
Blammin' Flammin' Jab. <laughs> My class, this is wonderful. I, I don't, I don't know what to say. That's not all, Miss Frizzle. We still have the big finale. A big finale? Oh, what could that be? Ready, Arnold? You bet. Oh, class, where did you ever get such a lovely cake? <laughs> you wouldn't believe us if we told you. The baker just gave it to us, said it was ruined. Something about a moth. But frankly, we didn't believe him. <laughs> As I always say, chemistry, it's a piece of cake. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>